All right, YouTube land, we're back with another video. Today we've got a little uh, uh, yellow, a custom built yellow uh, gatekeeper amplifier. It's got two 2290s in it. This amp is an amp that I sold on consignment for one of my customers. And the guy that I sold it to uh, thought it was sideband ready, but it's not, it wasn't, it was class C. So, uh, and we know class C is no way no for sidebands. So what we've done is uh, I told him to send it back and we'd put a bias in it. So we biased the amplifier, we've got it clean, we reconfigured it a little bit and uh, cleaned it up and, and put a bias on it uh, so it would be uh, especially pure as the signal that's going in it. Now, we're using a Cobra 29 LX for the dirty work. This radio is specially pure. Basically what you put in this amp is what you get out. You put trash in, you get trash out. Now, uh, the amp is linear. Um, we're gonna be using, and I'm gonna zoom in here like I always do to show you guys because uh, I'm a firm believer I need to show the settings on the spectrum analyzer, on the scope, the watt meter, the whole thing, but you can't do that from back here. Uh, I could very easily, dis if, 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 you're, if, if I'm back here showing you everything at one time, I could very easily dis uh, mislead you on you you can't see the settings so we're going to boom in here so you can see the spe uh, settings because we don't want to uh, be accused of any tomfoolery and uh we'll show you each one you know as it's working here uh because that's the way it needs to be done if i'm way back here uh trying to tell you to see the whole thing you can't see how these settings are and that's very important especially for the guy that's spending money on getting this biased he wants to see that it's clean and how we're working so what we're doing, we got a 40 megahertz, oops, knocked my clip off. We got a 40 megahertz uh, center, for, uh, center frequency. And the reason we set that for 40 megahertz is we've got a 70 megahertz span. So we're looking from here to here, 70 megahertz. Okay. And we're doing 40 megahertz because we're wanting to split the difference between uh, the frequency we're working on, 27.205. And up here is 54 megahertz uh, where you're gonna see a spike, which is the second harmonic. Now it's very important that there's nothing else in this uh, to be considered spectrally pure. There can be nothing else in here as far as any other uh, spikes. So that's why we're showing you like this. Now we're gonna show you the scope, we're gonna show you everything, but we need to be zoomed in here so we can show you the settings. So we'll show you the scope and uh, it's really hard to tell by the camera this thing is really clean and I mean really clean so we're going to show you down here we're showing you uh, the center frequency this spike right here which is 27205 is a fundamental frequency and then of course we've got a spike at 54 megahertz there's no way around that you're always going to have your second uh, harmonic and your third harmonic uh, you'll always have some of that on the uh, on the, the only way I could do that is if I put a 54 megahertz bandpass in this, <coughs> a bandpass filter in this, or put a low pass filter in, it's gonna knock it down. It would knock it down considerably. So, but we are, we can consider ourselves spectrally pure because of, there's nothing else in between. So anyway, we'll look at this real quick. One, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, yo, one, two, three, four. Now, that's a 2500 watt slug. I meant to put a different one in there, but we're just going to go with it for this quick video. We're not really concentrating on watts anyway. We are concentrating on uh, if the amp is clean, but I need to show the watts so you can see. Well, wow, that little two pill is doing 250 watts PEP and it's clean. So, hello, one, two, three, four. Audio, check, check. One, two. Hello, radio. It's doing a hair over 250 on peaks. Hello, radio. One, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one. Audio, one, two. Audio, one, two. Hello, radio. One, two, three, four. Audio, one, two. Audio. Yeah, and like I say, it's looking good and uh, working good too. So, anyway, uh, that was just a quick video to show you guys uh, that we, uh, you know, we like to show it when we bias one that it, it is biased and spectrally pure. Now this is automatic sideband. Uh, that's why I do all of them. There's no switches to flip. You just go to sideband and go to talking. It's got an automatic delay. It doesn't affect it on AM whatsoever. So 
anyway we're gonna get out of here we just want to uh, show this real quick and uh, we got to get this thing uh, sent off uh, the guy's been waiting a while for it so uh, uh, for us to get this out for him so anyway y'all be safe be careful and be kind we'll catch you next time I'm gone bump bump